Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Taylor and on this channel we get into all things affordable beauty and we get into affordable beauty tips and synthetic wig reviews. So today we're back with another synthetic wig review and today's wig we're going to be reviewing is an Outre unit. This is Freya and I have her in the shade Dark Root Face Framing or DRFF6 honey over chocolate. So if you wanna learn more about this unit, my thoughts, pros and cons, where to purchase this unit, if you're interested, then keep on watching. So this is the unit, this is how she looks. This is the shade honey over chocolate. So you have this, I don't even really know how to describe this type of dye job, but you have your honey hair color, like a 619 color coming over uh, with some bag highlights of the more brunette shade. I'm just going ahead and get to the pros and the cons. So I'm gonna start off with the cons. The cons for me, Y'all, I never do this, but the con for me, number one, is the color. I hate it, I hate it. I thought, you know, based off this stock card, it will look nice and so well blended on the model, but it does not look very, you know, blended on me. It looks very choppy and it's just, it's not a seamless blend and I just feel like Outre could do better. This is my personal opinion. I feel like they could have, I don't know what kind of magic they worked on this here model, but they could have got, you know, something like that to happen for your girl and for others who want to try this unit. So I just, I do not like this color. I do not, and I can't take it off because I'm going out in public, so I'm just have to rock it confidently. I'm about to pretend like I like it, but I don't like it, y'all. I don't know, there's some funky thing going over here. Like, I parted the hair and I tried to put my wax stick to just kind of give myself that definition at the hairline. It's not giving that. It was just acting very wonky. Also, another con for me is that the ends are not as trimmed as it is once again advertised on this here stock card. So on the stock card, like you can see that there's like a little bit of a blunt trim. Um, and so I, you know, I understand that these images are not always accurate. And I think they put a disclaimer on those stock cards, but still as a person that is just a wig lover and that sees things and that's very visual, like, like most people who, you know, are consumers of fine goods, um, they feel like they want things to not be false advertisement and I'm one of those people so I didn't like that at all. It's a bit of a flyaway city kind of unit so kind of don't like that. And she's just, it's just the color for me. I really wish the whole entire unit was this color alone and just had the ombre root situation going on where it's giving you more brunette into, or like an ash, I don't know y'all. I just wish that this top color, the honey color was more of 
I wish this honey color was the entire color of the unit. That I'm moving over to the pros. The pros is that it was definitely easy to install. That's why I actually really love um, Outer Perfect Hair Lines, one of my favorite um, collections of wigs because it makes it so simple. I do like the, the root situation because despite the mess going on down below, the top is what I feel like kind of saves the day with the, the sprouting roots and how the roots are, you know, not like a direct blonde. So it's not a 613 unit. So I do like the length of this unit. I feel like it's not too obnoxious or anything like that. And yeah, uh, is that it for the pros? I don't know. Oh, and also I was really fond of the ear tab situation. The way that they set up the lace is so that it stops right at your ear and gives you like a little guidance for you to cut it. I actually did cut my ear lace correctly this time so I won't feel too ashamed if the wind blows my hair back. Let's get into some of the claims of the stock card. The stock card lets you know that this is a fully hand tied 13 by six frontal. So I could have put a side part as well, but I want to do down the middle and I'm glad I did because I've seen side parts and I don't like them. Ear to ear soft HG transparent lace um, and comes with a pre-attached elastic band and it's a pre-plugged pre hairline and, heat, and it is heat styling friendly. Like I thought once again, that this was gonna be a unit that I could, my head could not fit. Um, and I thought it was because this, this unit comes with a pre-attached elastic band and this may be why, because I didn't put it on immediately. She's still snug AF and I don't like that because lately I've been doing units that are not inclusive of my big head girls and I don't like that because I want everybody to try it if they like it. But this one, yeah, she's, she's snug AF. With, with, she comes with about six special colors with this color included and yeah, I purchased her from wigtypes.com. I believe I paid about 52 bucks for her. So she's like in the 40 to 45 to 50 range. I feel like maybe if you all try this unit in some of their more, I don't even know, like maybe some other colors advertised on the stock card, like this, um, this Cajun spice color, I think that might be cute. Or maybe this like chocolate color. I don't know, or, or this like maple brown color on the other side. Like maybe try something a little bit safer. I really, you know, obviously I love blonde on this channel. If you look at some of my other uploads, I do not shy away from trying blonde hair. And I just feel like blonde hair is a part of my signature look at this point. So I I don't know, I don't shy away from those type of things. So therefore I was like, oh yeah, let me get that one for sure. But I just don't really like this unit. Like I feel like if I see it, if you all see it on me again, I'll have definitely customized it and done some different things to it to get it to work for me. So that's it for today's video. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Comment down below your thoughts on this unit. Let's stay in touch on social. Social handle will be included above. Um, don't forget to subscribe if I didn't say that already. I probably did, I'm kind of repetitive. Check out some of my uploads if you are into affordable beauty tips. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you, stay beautiful, and stay safe.